My name is Brenda Brown, and my husband is Pastor Horace Brown. We've lived here in Valdosta over 20 years, and we've raised four children in the Valdosta City School System. And I would like to, myself, give the Valdosta City School teachers and the whole system a hand, okay? being is because, remember this, when I leave this podium, that one child can impact a nation. Okay, my four children, one has graduated out of the city school system, she is studying in Pittsburgh, and she's into North Carolina studying for a PhD in neuroscience. She did graduate studies in Pittsburgh University for Alzheimer's research. I have a son who has graduated from Valdosta High School who's working on fighter jets over in Korea. I have a son that's over in El Paso, both of which are married. He's a military police. He's graduated from Valdosta High School. I have a daughter here that is in, attending college here in the city of Valdosta. One child will impact the nation. But what I wanted to say to the Chamber of Commerce, I don't know all the board members that are here, that I would like to take each one of the board members and place them in a struggling family's home of all ethnic groups and colors so that they can see that we are trying to push these children into excellence. Amen. You have to have these children be afforded a chance. And I believe that the consolidation would take away that chance for the children to be afforded a chance to impact a nation. Remember, one child could impact a nation. And I would like to address this to this board members that somebody had to be working on this for quite some time. Mm -hmm. I want to say, how did we get to this point? And within the next 20 years, how are we going to stay out of this and not diddle this situation right now? The question that I heard last was how we're going to stay out of this in the next 20 years. <laughs> Actually, the law states that the QE group or any group uh, can bring this same question back to us a year from now. My, my suggestion with this is that we vote strong enough that they won't dare bring it back within another year. <laughs> 